three, two, one. <laughs> we are live. Hi. <laughs> yeah, one was already done. Check it out. This is part two. This is how to eat fish like a boss. Awesome and MVP and crew, right? And if you got an awesome Sarah like I do, she would a tartar sauce. That's awesome. You're going to have to have your place to throw away the pins and back. You got to throw. Um, if you like crunching the tails, that's a good thing. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. This is lovely. Check this out. You get to eat with the tendrils. Check this out, people. You just pull this fin right here. Like I was telling you when I was cleaning them earlier. I had my wonderful, amazing, awesome neighbor fry these up for, for us. And really chunk of meat off, like so. And you'll see, there's one half of the back strap. A lovely chunk of awesome, totally badassness right there. Then we're going to dip in some tartar. Mm. This is what it's all about, people. Whoa. Living the dream. Give me some of this tartar. Here. Give me some of this tartar. All right, then we're going to go to this. I'm going to show you how to do this. Because I've choked multiple times on bones. If you got kids and stuff, you don't want to be choking on bones. I decided to do this video. Besides something different than tarantulas and snakes and stuff. Um, and besides, Mikey wanted to uh, share his awesome fishing thing with you guys. So you got to check this little area here. Get them little, little bones. Them little bones can get stuck in your throat. And that's not a cute thing at all. So then, have another big back strap. Mm, 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 mm. Excellently seasoned. <laughs> I'm getting spoiled over there by mommy. And this is just not. This is not even scratching the surface of the fish. There were 250 fish in there, which is ridiculous. 200. Even the little ones here. These are absolutely awesome. Don't forget to crunch the tails. Mm hmm. Because <laughs> you're a kingfisher, son. Okay. Love this. Just what you make of it. But people, I can tell you one thing. Most of my viewers are watching deserve this. So, time could not be better than right now. Like right now to go fishing. And then you break, just break that piece off. Don't be scared to get your hands dirty. Because you don't want to miss that piece. Fish, how's it taste, Mikey? How's it taste, Mikey? Good. Good. Justin, yeah, you take this right here. When you get done, you have something that looks like it come off a Garfield. Mommy, this? Perfect. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't waste it. Don't waste money. Um, yeah, it works really good, people. There's more being cooked as we speak. I just wanted to show you guys real quick. And if you want to use your fingers all the way, you can. You can just use your thumb, push up on this like that, and right there, and perfectly, perfectly, take that fillet right off of there with no problem. One bone, and you can do the same on the opposite side. Just give a slight, slight pressure with your thumb, placing up. I know you want something, dog. Quit whining. I am alive. Don't want don't want y'all to think I'm spoiling my dog or nothing. Yeah, mm. mm -mm. Yep. So you got that like that. And you pull to show y'all the whole thing with the whole fish. And then you can take this belly meat right here. Put it to the side. Take this belly meat here. Put it to the side. You want to do this in this manner because if you try to eat the fish right off the bone, accidents can and will happen and have multiple times with these little pan fish. And you should end up with something that looks like this right here. You can go on farther trying to uh, pry and manipulate this or don't most of the time. Don't like waste, but nothing goes to waste here. 
good thing about living on the farm, life on the farm, there is plenty of stuff that can eat the stuff that I don't eat. Mm-mm-mm-mm. What do you think, son? Mm-mm-mm. No. Don't want to be cautious, though. Could be a bone. Hmm? Hmm? Mikey says 20 out of 20 people. That's a pretty good rating. But you liked it. Hmm? But you liked it. Mm-hmm. Lovely. Mommy's got it down pat. 20 out of 20. Here, dog. I'll never start feeding your dogs from the table. You do. You're going to deal with that stuff. Mm-mm-mm. It's okay, Panda. We haven't forgotten you, baby. Mm-mm-mm. It's not safe for fish bones to your uh, dogs, by the way. They can choke them. I won't do that. Oh, yeah, and Panda's starting to walk now. Slightly. He did, in fact, break his back. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Fish cheeks. That fish does look appetizing. It is. It is absolutely amazing. I'm sorry I can't be sharing with everybody. That's poor chop. That is not pork chop. That is actual fish. I would not lie to you guys. You can watch. You can watch the earlier video where I was actually cleaning them. Pork chop had tails and tiny bones. <laughs> they were hilarious. Fantula Cheney looks good. It is. Fantula Cheney. That's how it's pronounced, everybody. Fantula Cheney. Junior, no, it doesn't. Junior, you don't know what you're missing. It's very dry. Do you need to cook the food? No, it's perfect. It's not dry at all. Um, you're not getting a good view. And I got juice running up my fingers. Get y'all a better look here. Look at this. Look at this juice. Very juice. Very moist. Absolutely amazing. Um, for fresh water fish. <laughs> good. Be careful for bones, my love. Um, another reason, just in case a kid chokes on the bone, I'll show you how to dig it out of his throat. You gotta stick your finger way back in there and just go like that. You better be careful. <laughs> I've got one out. <laughs> yeah. Eating fish is a slow moving process. Pendula time. Glad to hear Panda is working some. Yes, walking some. He's lifting up. I did feel uh, the vets wanted to put him down, so we just. Took him home and said, We're going to do, do with it the best we can. Mm -hmm. We had with him. Water yeah. He light, had. light massages and stuff. We take him down to the creek and let him go in there where, where he goes. Because it has been some warmer days and we don't want to lose our panda. It's very rarely that you find a half coyote, half uh, blue healer. I don't really care too much for coyotes, but panda has been really good. That's a pork chop, huh, fish? <laughs> That's funny. Looks delicious. Looks great to me. Mm. I'll tell you, that homemade tartar sauce is absolutely amazing. Get down. That homemade tartar sauce is absolutely amazing. Mm-mm-mm. -mm -mm. I'm about to get in the background. Get there. Get, get me some water. I'll make. Well, this is awesome. Most of the time, our fish fries take place outdoors in beer flats. What um, little cardboard things we just fry up fish like that. Lay some paper towels out in there. Drop your fish on there. Hush puppies and stuff like that. Country living can be absolutely fun if you make it. Mm hmm. <laughs> when it comes to video gaming, I'm very old school, friends. Mm -hmm. Love Pac Man. Love Space Invaders. Mm 
This is awesome. <laughs> I kind of feel bad eating in front of all of you guys, but I wanted to show you how this is done. And this is how we do it. Ta la 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 la. Yeah, how... My feet get spoiled first before I eat. Yeah. We do this quite often. We just don't never share it very often. I used to make cooking videos and stuff like that. Y'all can check out videos like how to cook a Pac Man frog Tindall style. That was a greatest hit. Absolutely amazing. No monetization. So y'all don't have to worry about me making any money off of that because I figured that I would play a Christmas song in there and they demonetize it, but still allow it to be viral epic video. Absolutely amazing. Damn, this fish is good. Tell you what. We're going to have to do this even more. <laughs> Chicken, real man food. Oh, yeah. Real man food. Yeah, we got, so I got 600 pounds of chicken right now. What on the freezer? Mm hmm. Yeah. He said real man food, we should give him chicken. We ate a lot of chicken. I can uh, just picked up the other day about, well, about a month ago, I guess. We, pack, we packed it up. You get a really good deal on chicken here. 40 pound boxes for $6, anywhere from $6 to 30 bucks. But it's still good. Absolutely awesome. So I take advantage of that all the time. Always searching away for financial freedom. Edward, Sarah, and Mikey, you guys rock. Thank you, Tarantula Time. It was awesome. I hope you guys all follow suit. Try to get you some uh, fish. Well, I know he's down where there's. Mm hmm. There was... <laughs> and I'm not flooding this fish in front of you by any means. Well, it's absolutely an amazing meal, but I wanted you guys to see and enjoy. And it's awesome that my little Mikey here bring home the bacon. Okay. That's a real man here. The the fish, the bacon, metaphorical son. <laughs> Mikey's like, who brought the bacon? <laughs> you brought the bacon, my boy. Yeah, Mm -mm -mm. Kind of messy a bit. Mm -hmm. These are absolutely perfect size for this. I'm not going to bore y'all with the other three or four or five plates that we got. Three or four or five. Or never frying and frying and frying. Yep. Me and Sarah had some other stuff to do, so. We decided to share with neighbors for their excellent cooking skills. That way we can move forward. There's so much stuff. We always help people around here. Mm hmm We help where we can. Mm hmm And no good uh no good deed goes unrewarded. Or unpunished in some cases. Those are gone. Which is fun. Those are not a towel. Hmm? They're not a towel in that pile. Mm -hmm. Not just. Every towel has been crunched. Hmm. 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 He's my king now. Hmm. He still prints as one of them around. All right, girl. <laughs> Princess would be girl. Mm mm mm. Gotta wash these hands. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Me and Edward jump around and we feel, you know what's called my king or his king? Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> Mikey. We call him my king. So he's my king or Sarah's king. Sarah's over there. Just clearing plates and stuff. Mm -hmm. 
Thank you guys for joining us. We appreciate it. We're going for round two and three and four. Small Town Exotic says, hi, Mikey. Hi. Um, let me see. You, know, you don't fry fish. We boil it. Um, Junior don't know. That goldfish. No, it is uh, a hybrid between copper. All right, my friends. Eat on Callium. Mikey, do you remember me? Oh. Who? That's a, <laughs> oh, that's a no, I guess. Trying the time. I got to head out, guys. Yeah, I'm fixing to go out too, my friend. I had to go with a friend and see his collection of 200 plus tarantula. I'll talk to you. Wow. Um, hey, get pics. Vlog it if he'll let you. Do a video. I would love to see that 200 plus tarantula. All right, everybody. Peace, love, and happiness, and all that good shit. Like, subscribe, tell your friends, share my videos, watch my older videos while you wait for new ones. And the next one, well, there might be another one tonight. I'm not sure, but if it is, it's going to be off the chain. Yep. Um, yeah, my hair is kind of uh, 80s punk rocker now. I ain't got a slick back or nothing. All right, I'm out of here, people.